Hello po! Uh, kumusta po kayong lahat? In this video, we're going to rationalize uh, science, uh, general education science um, tests. So, meron akong 10 questions dito na pinost sa page ko sa Facebook. And then, sasagutan natin siya, okay? So, the first question is, In an ocean biome, which of the following is the primary producer? Because we have primary producer, secondary, uh, yeah, secondary, uh, yeah, a primary producer, I'm sorry. Uh, we're, we're the first producers. Or, or, followed by the consumers. First consumer, second order consumer, like that stuff. Okay, so ayan siya. Is it uh, the al algae, phytoplankton, grass, small fish, none of the above. Okay, so ang sagot dito is phyto uh, phytoplanktons. They're, uh, what's this? Phytoplanktons. There are uh, organisms, tiny organisms that uh, makes up the, the uh, producers community in the uh, marine ecosystem. Okay, so there I go. Algae is just uh, one of those organisms, but they are not the one which produces food or or uh, I mean becomes the 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 auto troops in the ocean biome. They are just one of those organisms, but they are not food to all uh, uh, ocean. Uh, are marine organisms okay so grass cannot be because grass is in the uh what's this terrestrial area okay small fish are not because this small fish also are uh what's this consumers okay there you go so the answer here is letter b phytoplankton number two a food chain is characterized by uh the following except okay except so going you so it's a negative fact question Okay, so except that means which one is the wrong, uh, which uh, of the choices is the wrong one. Okay, so how each living things get food that's uh, being shown in the food chain. Oh, food chain and food web. Uh, food chain is just a single strand or like a single, uh, what's this, from producer to the, the apex or the last consumer. Uh, whereas the food web is made up of series of, uh, what's this, food chains. Okay, so letter B, how nutrients and energy are passed from uh, the from creature to creature. So that's true. It begins with a plant life. That's always true because food chain cannot uh, be called food chain without producer. And it ends with animal life. That's true. That's the apex uh, or the, the tip or the uppermost uh, predator. Then letter E, how each living thing help each other. They don't help each other actually. Okay. It's not shown by that, so that's letter E. Next one, how much energy is taken by the consumer? So, uh, halimbawa, yung producer gumawa ng 100% uh, worth of energy. Yung first order consumer will just get 10% of it. And then the second order uh, consumer will also get the 10% of that first order consumer. Okay, so always 10% of the energy. Okay, ganun siya. Number four, in an ocean biome, which of the following is the primary consumer? Primary consumer are the uh, phytoplanktons or tiny organisms or plants. Uh, they're the producers, anyway. And here is the, the primary consumer. The first order consumers are the zooplan zooplanktons or the tiny animals, okay? Next one, hearing mackerel and tunas are just, uh, what's this? One of those predators. And what's this? Second order and third order consumers. Next one. Number five. Which of the following is an autotrophs? Autotrophs are, are organisms that manufacture their own food, like plants or grasses and stuff, or, or the phytoplanktons in the ocean biomase. The other one is heterotrophs or those consumers, like animals, okay? And saprotrophs are uh, organisms that feed on. Uh, dead bodies like fungi, what more? Okay, so yung mga decomposers, ganun, saprotrophs. Okay, there you go. So here, which of the following is an autotrophs? Autotrophs means uh, those which manufacture their own food through the process of photosynthesis, and that's grass. Okay, there you go, letter A. Next one, number six, which of the following is not a heterotroph? Okay, he not a heterotroph, that means it's a auto, it's an autotrophs, okay? First order consumer, second order consumer, third order consumer, fungi, or none of the above. 
Okay, so not heterotroph, so that means none, not, not here. Okay, there's none here. So it's letter E. Uh, it's none here. Ah, sorry, 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 fungi. Sorry, 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 sorry pala. Sorry, sorry, it's fungi because het not heterotrophs. So it could either be autotroph or saprotroph. Since there is no, all of the choices A, B, C are all heterotrophs and letter D is a saprotroph. Or it's not heterotroph is a fungi or the saprotrophs. Okay, number seven, which of the following is a saprotroph? Saprotroph. Sorry, <laughs> grass, chicken, algae, phytoplankton, and fungi. Of course, it's fungi or fungi. Okay. Next, number eight. Which of the following relationship demonstrates commensalism? Is it commensalism? Uh, one helps the other, but the one that helps is not harm. Okay. So there we go. An orchid in a tree. So this is. Okay. So this is letter A. A rose and a chrysanthemum growing in the same pot. That's competition. Letter C, a tapeworm in the five-year-old boy. That's uh, parasitism. Tuna and sardines are predation. Yeah, so it's letter A. Because the tree is helping the orchid to get sunlight, okay, by having it stick on its, uh, what's this, trunk, tree trunk, and in order for it to get sunlight. But the, the orchid is not harming the tree, okay? That's commensalism. Number nine, how much energy does the third order consumer get from eating the second order consumer? With 500 units of energy. Okay? So, 10%. Yung sabi ko nga, uh, 10%. Okay? So, second order consumer, na consume siya ng 5,000 5, units of energy. So, 10% of 5,000, that's 500. So, that's letter B. Okay, yung third order, yung second order consumer, 5,000 units, 10% uh, of 5,000 is 500, and that is the amount of energy or the units of energy that is taken in by the third order consumer, which is 500 units, okay? As I've told you earlier, uh, nung isang question dun, 10% lagi. Okay, so, halimbawa naman, pag yung third order consumer na to, na nakakuha ng 500 units of energy from the second order consumer, pag kinain siya ng fourth order consumer, magiging amakwa lang ng energy units na, ng fourth order consumer would be 50. Okay, laging 10% po tayo. Okay, last one. Light energy is converted into what kind of energy during the process of photosynthesis? Okay, so, food energy, of course, is not because it's just like a helping stuff. Chemical energy, yes, it does. Okay, solar energy is uh, chemical energy, not physical, not mechanical energy, or not also potential energy. Okay, so it's a chemical energy. There we go. I hope this one helps you a lot, guys. And uh, as I says, uh, don't forget to subscribe and share my video. Also, tick that bell for notifications of my future videos. But if you like this video, please uh, click that thumbs up. Okay, thank you so much. Bye bye. God bless.